Good morning. Welcome to a short week of school and Thanksgiving week. So there's two things I want to talk to you about today. First, let me talk about the library. We've made some changes at lunchtime. So instead of having 40 passes for the library and kids can go either to the computer lab or to the library, we've cut it down. There's only going to be 10 computer passes each day for each lunch. And those computers are going to be the ones to use uh, next to Mrs. Scanlon's desk. The big computer lab in the library is going to be closed from now on. No more video games during lunchtime. And then the library passes are for those students who want to just go in and finish up some work and get some things done. So make sure that you have that in your mind before you ask for a pass, because if you go down and you want to play video games, you're going to be out of luck. So the second thing is, this Wednesday is the last school day before the big OSU U of O Civil War football game. So I'm declaring it a spirit day. Wear college colors. You can wear U of O or OSU, or if you don't want to do either one of those, your favorite college. And if you don't want to do any of those, you can wear West Sylvan spirit wear. Also, extra bonus, that will also be a hat day. So, have a great short week. Some thinly sliced white portion of the Oh, Briggy, we have guests. Hello, and welcome back to West Sylvan time. Today our topic is ordering yearbooks. There are three ways that you can order a yearbook. The first way you can order is online at yearbookordercenter.com. Your order number is 6339. You will need that number to order. Method number two, pay with check or cash. Bring in exactly $30 in cash or check, check payable to West Sylvan, with the pre-order form below, no later than January 29th. You can also wait till June and try to get a copy if there are some left, but this does not guarantee you a yearbook. Why wait and take a chance? Pre-order today! Wait, say what? Your shoe has a soul. No, not the one under your foot. The one inside. A soul that lives on. A soul you created. With every game, every move, every run. Producing something unique and individual. But every shoe also has a lifespan. And when it's over, what do you do? Do you simply lose it? No, you reuse it. Nike's Reuse a Shoe program unwinds, unbinds, and regrinds old athletic shoes to be reborn as Nike Grind, a versatile, resilient material that's been turned into countless courts, fields, and tracks, thanks to nearly 30 million pairs of shoes collected from people just like you. You gave your shoes a soul. Now give them a second life. Have a pair of shoes to donate? You can donate athletic shoes of any brand if they're worn out or new. Just donate them here. But don't donate dress shoes, sandals, flip-flops, or any shoes with metal in them. These shoes will be used for Nike grind, so they will go to a good purpose. This is Project Green's new addition to the school. It's an art contest. First, you look at what the week's drawing is, and it'll always be posted right here. This week, it's an order. Second, you make your own drawing of it, and remember to put your full name on it. You enter it in this box. Last, you wait for us to announce the winning drawing on the morning show, and whoever drew it gets candy. Also, we'll post your drawing around the school. The rules are very simple. The drawing must be done by you, and only you. You cannot trace the drawing or print one off the internet. Only one entry per person, please. And on the drawing, please include your full name, your second period class, and your grade. The drawings will change weekly, and please turn your drawing in by Thursday. Thank you, good luck, and have fun. Hey guys, this is Allie, and joining me today is... <laughs> Reflections is an art program which we have been invited to join in this year. 
The theme for this year's art program is the world be a better place if dot dot dot. All you need to do is make a dance or a film or a piece of music to submit to the contest. The deadline for your film is Thursday, January 8th at the front office. Awards will be handed out to the regional winners and can be sent to state level and then continued on to the national championship if qualified. You can attend the Oregon PTA lunch in April and soon see the students work for Because you know I'm all about that bass, about that bass, no. Zone boy. Mm -hmm.